Hello, hello. <laughs> Why do I feel like, I don't know. It feels really close. I mean, it is. That's better. Because I'm like, wait a minute. Yeah, that's better. All right. I'm trying to give you some space, though. Well. <laughs> hey, Jeffrey. Kylie. What's up, peeps? Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> Hey, Christy. Hi, Sally. Hi, Elaine. Hello, Lily's mom, a.k.a. Joanne. <laughs> Ooh, the chat's going quick. Hi, Jen. Hi, Grace. I mean, Dana. <laughs> Lori. Oh, you just opened your package, Lori? Awesome. Lynn, Jill, Papa Bear, Wandy's Farmhouse, Andrea Gennaro. Hang on, let me see. Oh, you got the package? It was Everything was okay, I hope. Whoops, get over there. Hey, Cheryl, Barb. Hi, Randy. I'm good, Wendy, how are you doing? Hi, Rose. <clears throat> Stacy. Oh, good, yeah. I'm sure it took you about a half hour to get it open. <laughs> You're doing great. That's awesome. What are you doing? That thing was like right on here. And every time oh. you like touched the table, it was like. Thick, 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 oh. thick, thick. It was driving me nuts. <laughs> All righty then. Oh, she loved it. Good. Awesome. Hi, Anna. How are you? Linda, Linda, Linda. <laughs> <laughs> Mail fraud. <laughs> oh, good, Linda. Awesome. Um, I just wanted to let everyone know that I did hear from my friend that I asked you all to pray for. Um, she did, in fact, have a heart attack. Um, but she she knew she was having one, so she immediately called nine one one. They did a um, an angiogram and found out she had um, a blocked artery. Um, it was 90% blocked. So they uh, did put a stent and everything, and um, she's now home, and she's doing much better, but she's very, very exhausted from all of the, um, the meds that they have her taking. So thank you to all of you for your prayers for her. She's doing better. So, yes. Yeah, I know. I was really, really worried. Hi, Nita. I'm sure it is. I hope I don't ever have to, you know, yeah, but she, she is. She's doing better and she was very thankful for all the prayers, so. You had three put in, Linda? Wow. Yeah. So, that is the good news of the day. Um, so, I mean, you know, hey, what's up there, Elizabeth? Lucid Curious? Um... So anyways, I um, am doing um, a few different things today. I'm having more offer up items than normal. Um, I'm going to have them periodically throughout the sale. Um, usually I only have like five, but I um, decided, hey Liz, how are you? Hi Winter1299. I decided to sprinkle them throughout um, the sale, so... Just going to try it out and see how it works. Hey, Carrie. How you doing? Hello, Mary. Hi, Irene. 
Deb Clark. Yes. Thumbs up, guys. Don't forget my thumbs up, please. They definitely help. Aw, uh, hey, Jane. How you doing, my girl, Jane? From Doggone Happy Vintage. Hi, Judy. Hi, Lois. Aw, oh, awesome. Thank you, Sheila. I went to this, um, I went to an estate sale yesterday and got a bunch of stuff. And then I decided at the last minute to go back today for half price day. So I got a bunch more stuff. So should be a good haul video. Hi, Mary Scott. Hi, Sue. Kendra Joe. How you doing? Oh. You said your family home. <laughs> Sandy, I mean, Trisha, <laughs> thanks for stopping in. All right, so I think we're going to get started. We have 118 here right now and only 45 thumbs up, though. Thumbs up. I already did it, homie. Oh, you already did it? Yep. All right. <laughs> All right, guys. So I guess I'm just going to, I'm going to start with what's in front of me like I usually do. I have this really nice set of Corning. Um, I consider these to be restaurant wear. And um, they're just two small, uh, probably like a cup of soup sized little bowls. Or you could put um, a couple scoops of ice cream or you could put um, berries in there, whatever you would like. Um, there's the marking on the back. I don't know if you could see it. But they're in really good shape. I cannot remember this pattern for the life of me. I want to say it's like medallion something or I don't know. I can't remember at all. But you get both um, bowls for $8, number 28. $8, number 28 for the restaurant wear bowls. They're nice. They're thick too, you know. Casey ATX. Okay, Carrie. Oh, I just noticed. This one has a little teeny chip on the outside, Carrie. If you don't want them, let me know. There's still, there's a little chip here. I didn't see that. The other one is okay. Hey, Cindy. You're wrapping my box now, huh? My daughter's like, Ma, stay away from the live sales. <laughs> it's okay. All right. Sorry, I just I just noticed that. What the heck? All right. I know every day I have packages coming you from used to talk about me. <laughs> All right. Next up, uh, this is one of Jessica's items, but I'm gonna do it for her. It's this very cool. Um, I believe it's a duck teapot. The blue and white design. Oh, from Maine. Hi, Sherry. That's a place I've always wanted to visit. Maybe one day I'll get there. Um, the, ba the back is pretty. His butt. <laughs> um, this is the top. There's just tape on it. It just comes off. There's Yeah, there's tape on it. Um, it's hand-painted, made in China. It's not old. But it kind of looks old. It's kind of cool. So this is $10, and it's number 23. $10, number 23 for the duck uh, teapot. All right. Hi, Elizabeth. Oh, you love it? Well, buy it. <laughs> it's $10, number 23. <laughs> 
Sorry, I couldn't help myself. <laughs> All right. Um, next, I have a very pretty... Let me measure it first really quick. Okay, it's five and three quarter inches tall. And it's this really pretty lovebird um, planter. Okay, Elizabeth wants that. <laughs> um, it does have, and I think this is a manufacturer defect right here. But um, that's the only other issue. That's the bottom. There's no markings. That's the back. So this is going to be $12, number seven. Three o'clock, Lorraine. $12, number seven for the love, loving birds. <laughs> love bird planter. Joyce Myers. Joyce Myers, you get the love bird planter. Thank you. All righty. Next, I have um, a red wear creamer. It's got a rooster on there. It's in perfect condition. There's no cracks, no chips, no markings. Very, very cute. And it kind of has um, a slight luster wear finish to it. But I think it's adorable. $10, number 38. $10, number 38 for the Redware Creamer. And this is about four inches tall. Four inches tall. Linda, Linda Dickerhoff. You got it, Linda. Linda, Linda, listen, Linda. You know she's going to do that every time. You do it too. I don't do that. Yes, you do. No, when I she don't. pops on, you go, Linda, Linda, Linda. It's the same <laughs> thing. <laughs> All right. Um, how about some kitties today? All right. Now, I know everybody finds these. Everybody. I've found them. I can't tell you how many times. These are the little Home Co. kitties. These are in perfect condition. No chips, no cracks. They are just adorable. I just, they're, I love the, the detailing, like on the fur and everything. But they are adorable. You have to go grocery shopping. Oh, fun, fun, fun. So these are going to be $10, and they are number 21. $10, number 21 for the Home Co. Kitties. Linda, Linda. All right, Linda, you got the kitties. They are adorable. All right, um, let me see. Yes, I'm going to, I think. All right, next I have, I hate grocery shopping too. I mean, I don't mind doing the actual shopping, but it's loading it all in the car, them coming home, unloading it from the car, and putting it all away. I don't like unloading it. I don't like putting it away. <clears throat> it's a pain. Next I have this beautifully detailed bud vase. Look at this vase. Little cherub. Yes, it's got a beautiful little cherub on there. It does have some paint loss on the gold. The back of it is just plain white. No markings on the bottom, but it's just beautiful. I think I love the um all of the like scrolling detailing. Look at that. It's very pretty. This is $8 and it's number 40. $8, number 40 for the bud base. It's pretty. Linda, Linda. Okay, Linda, you got it. 
All right. Some more like Hollywood Regency, I guess. Um, let's take this tag off. I have this very cool Kleenex box cover. And of course, it's for the small little square boxes of Kleenex. It's in excellent condition. No, uh, no issues. Um, it's brass, I think. Looks like brass to me. Hi, Brenda. So this is going to be $12, and it's number 14. $12, number 14, for the Kleenex box cover. Polly's Projects. Paula! It is yours, Paula. Thank you. Okay, <clears throat> okay, I have um, some more restaurant wear. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> I have this, uh, this is from Mayor China, and I did show this before, and it didn't sell. It was a while ago, so I thought I would try again. Um, it's this really pretty creamer and sugar. Uh, it's an open sugar bowl. There was no lid, and it's just white with the gold, um, gold trim. No cracks, no chips, no paint loss. There's the Mayor China. Mark on the bottom. So you get the set. You get both of these for $10, number 22. $10, number 22 for the Mayor Brothers Restaurant Wear Creamer and Sugar. Oh, Cindy. Cindy Luhu. You got it, Cindy. Thank you. Alrighty. Okay. I am going to part with. Oh, hey, what's up, Celeste? That's okay. I only started like not even 10 minutes ago. I am going to be parting with my Holt Howard chickens, roosters. Um, so. I bought this from um, Thrift U, the um, napkin holder, but he the tip of his beak is missing, just the very tip. But everything else is intact. There are no cracks, uh, no crazing. So it's the napkin holder, and I have the two salt and pepper shakers. These are in perfect condition. There's no cracks, no chips, no, no breaks or anything anywhere. Some fuzzies. And um, here is the thing on the bottom, the marking. But anyway, so you get both um, salt and pepper shakers and you get the napkin holder, all three for $14, number 44. $14, number 44 for the Holt Howard set. Cheryl Hoskins. All right, Cheryl, you got it. Got to clean it up a little bit before I send it to you. Okay, here. <laughs> Yay, Cheryl said. <laughs> All right. Um, next I have that was the scale in the bathroom that Binks knocked over. <sighs> he plays with a pipe cleaner, you know. I coil it up. And it probably went behind the scale, and he All was trying Binksy. trying to get it out and knock the scale over and All scared down. the crap out of me. <laughs> but anyways, I have 
a single little salt shaker. Little skunk. Look how cute he is. He looks like Flower from um, Bambi. Don't have the little mate, but I thought he would make just a cute little decor piece. He's a little cutie. He's $4, number 17. Yes, he's an orphan skunk. <laughs> $4, number 17. Cheryl Hoskins, I believe. Yep. All right, Cheryl. You're giving a home to my orphan skunk. Thank you very much. All right. I know this is going to be a popular item. Um, this gorgeous blue vase. That shape looks like the ones that they put on by the, in the cemetery. Thanks for ruining the moment. No, no. <laughs> looks like a cemetery vase, she said. Yeah, it does. The oh, shape of it. my word. Anyways, uh, <laughs> I think it might be anchor hacking. I'm not sure, but it's like sandwich glass. Beautiful shade of blue. It's gorgeous. It's uh, eight and a half inches tall. Very, very pretty. It's got like, um, I don't know. They look like maybe cone flowers or something on there. So this is $12 and it's number 35. $12, number 35. It is pretty. It's the color. Polly's proud. Oh, I knew Paula was going to go for that. I would just like to specify that I'm not saying that this particular vase should go in a cemetery, but I'm saying the shape of it is very similar to the ones that you find in cemeteries. Oh, okay. <laughs> you had a skunk. You know what, um, Cheryl? There's been a lot of skunks around. You notice? Around like you go, yeah, yeah. You go outside and it like stinks. So you know one of them got hit which I hate, you know, I hate to see animals getting hit, but, oh, we've been a lot of that around here lately with the skunks. Uh, let me see. All right. <laughs> All right. This next item is an offer up item. Um, it's gorgeous. And I... I don't know. I just think it's beautiful, and I thought I would let you guys decide what you think it's worth. So I decided to do her as an offer up. I'm just getting my um my time clock ready. Um, and it's this gorgeous um Virgin Mary planter with baby Jesus. She has the gold. It's absolutely beautiful. The gold halo. She's in perfect condition. There are no cracks, no chips. Um, there is crazing. But uh, yeah, she's, I'll show you up close. Look at that. Just gorgeous. So we are going to start the offers at $12. You'll have one minute to put your offers in uh, once we say start. Then after, um, the up. after the minute is up, we will type stop. We'll refresh and we will see whoever has the highest offer above the word stop. There are no markings. There's just a number that was like pressed into the, um, the clay. So I really don't know, um, you know, who made her, but she is just gorgeous. So we are going to um, get ready. All right, everybody. Starting, oh dear. Oh, come on, dude. At $12. All right. Thanks. Start. Hello, sir. Hey. You. She's she's just gorgeous. Yep, he's here. <laughs> oh Lord.
30. We got about, oh, 15 seconds left, everyone. Come here, Binx. Hi, Binx's tail, right? 10. No, oh, no. We got, I'm sorry. I looked at it wrong. We got like 35. <laughs> uh, 20 seconds left. Yes. Mm -hmm. 20 seconds. <laughs> oh, my Lord. All right, 10 seconds left. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one, stop. <laughs> All right, we're going to refresh. I got. Scrolling up to make sure. Okay. Uh, Elizabeth Gove. $42. Elizabeth dollars. Elizabeth Gove. You got this beautiful planter. Excuse me. Sonny. For forty two dollars, and she's number what number is she? Um, give me a second. Okay, Binks. Yeah, you have to go, dude. Uh, oh, Mary is fifty two. She's number fifty two, Liz. Binks. He's rubbing his face on my camera. Okay. There you go. Thank you, Elizabeth. All right, I'm gonna put this over here because well, I don't. I'm gonna it. bring it right now. I don't want it to get knocked over. I, uh, do. All what right. What the heck are you doing? Just go play with your pipe cleaner, kid. Got it. Oh, oh my <laughs> word! He's like a bull. He, he just barrels he through. He doesn't care. No, he doesn't. Not even a little bit. Um, Andrea, it's whoever is above the word stop. So you were probably after the word stop. Yeah. So. Okay. Um, next I have, let me see. What do I want to show? We're going to do this. Um. Uh, here is a very cool, um, I did, had no idea what this was. All you guys told me that this is a toast holder. Oh, I was thinking taco shell holder. No, it is a toast holder. And I'm trying to see on the bottom who made it. Just give me a second. Ow. What? I still have part of the sticker on here. It's made in England, I know that much. <laughs> Crown, Crownford, whatever. Made in England. <laughs> um, and it's really pretty. It has the rose, and then it also has uh, the leaves on each one of the, um, the separators. Really pretty. So this is ten dollars and it's number thirty-two. Ten dollars, number thirty-two. You could use it for anything. Linda, Linda. All right, Linda, you got it. Hey, Alex. How's it going? Thanks. Can I please have the table? <laughs> Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. What's going on, Alex? Are you getting ready for your sale tomorrow? All right. Next I have this adorable little owl toothpick holder. That's like glaze, I guess, that ran down inside of there. I love Binks, too, but he's, like, ridiculous. He's coming over here now. <laughs> um, so this little guy, he's got no cracks, no chips. He's a little cutie. He's $5, number 48. $5, number 48 for the owl toothpick holder. Cheryl. Cheryl. Cheryl, Cheryl. Thank you, Cheryl. Um, all right. 
I have. I just, I bought this because I just thought it was really pretty. And it would be nice, um, especially if you have uh, farmhouse decor. Uh, or if you are, you know, more on the plainer side. And it's this beautiful white pitcher. It's not iron stone, right? No, it's not iron stone. It's Napco. But it's just, it's very plain, but very pretty. And it is eight and a quarter inches tall. So it's a good size. It's really very pretty. It's $10, number 13. $10, number 13. This would look gorgeous with some flowers in it. Linda. Yeah, it's beautiful. All right, Linda, you got it. Linda, you got some quick internet today. All right. How about a really cute set of salt and pepper shakers? These are little acorn salt and pepper shakers. They're so cute and they sit like this. Kind of like on the diagonal. <laughs> Very cute. They have their stoppers. There is no name on them. But these are going to be $6 and they're number 20. $6, number 20 for the acorn salt and peppers. Cheryl. Cheryl. You got them. All right, um, how about, yeah, I'll do that one. How about a really fun piece of pottery? Yep, Alex's sale is tomorrow at 1 o'clock Eastern Standard Time, so don't forget. Don't forget. Um, this is, I just think this is adorable. Um, I don't know if this is a cat or a dog. I think it's a, it, well, I don't know. What do you guys think? <laughs> like, look at the tail. I mean, it's a planter and it's pottery. A dog? Polly says a cat. Alex, what do you think? Cat or a dog? We got mixed, we got mixed feelings here. Hey, Pamela, baby. Uh, dog. A dog? Dog. Elizabeth, a rabbit. <laughs> Dog, huh? Maybe it is a rabbit. It could be a rabbit. Uh, it's not a rabbit. Okay, think about this. That's not a look, rabbit. Just look. Cotton tail. Okay? Picture if the ears were a little bit higher. Look at the face with the little bits, the little whiskers. I don't think so. I don't know. I mean, honestly, if you Yeah, I know. I could I could see, I could see a bunny, but that was like my last thought of a bunny. But I mean, it could be a dog or a bunny. Those would be my A dog or a bunny? A lot of people are saying rabbit. Now. Irene thinks it looks like a rabbit. Oh, you see bunny? Mhm. Mm Hey, what's up, Jay? I know, I don't know either, but it's cute, right? <laughs> That's right. So he is just really cute, and he's made by Planters and Things. Planters and Things. So, yeah, I mean, it does have the little teeny tail on the back, so. Um, anyways, he is $10, number one. $10, number one for the whatever you want it to be planter. Elizabeth. <laughs> All right. There we go. What is it going to be, Elizabeth? A rabbit? I think Elizabeth's the first one that said a rabbit. Yep. Okay. It's a rabbit. All right. Next, I have... Um, this really pretty, it's um, it's a kitty music box, um, but it does have an issue. Um, the one side panel is uh, cracked in the glass here. 
but that's the top. And it plays the song Unchained Melody. Oh, Hi, Robin. Is that the one from Ghost? Yes. That's yes. a jam. So this is going to be $8, number 39. $8, number 39 for the Kitty Music Box. Oh, I love that song, The Righteous Brothers. So, $8, number 39. Teresa Faulkner. Teresa Faulkner, you got it. I know, it's so pretty. I love it. I barely even wound that, and it plays for a long time. Oh, there it is. It's done. <laughs> Hi, Sam Finn. Alrighty, next I have a very cool pottery mug. Um, this is really awesome. It reminds me of the ocean and the sand. It has a shell on the handle. It's got an applied handle. It's in excellent condition. I think it is so cool. It just, it's like ocean beach all the way. This is going to be $10 and it's number nine. $10, number nine. I think it's cool. Linda. You got it, Linda. That's a gorgeous mug. All right, next up is a piece of enamelware. Now this is not vintage, this is newer. Um, it's actually uh, made in Romania. And it is a very large uh, measuring cup. The ounces. Yes, ounces and milliliters. Uh, but they're actually, what I was using this for was utensils. Uh, so if you wanted to, that's what you could do with it as well. I didn't use, I know, I know, it's very bare. It's soon, a chamber pot, yeah. <laughs> um, Christmas is going to be going up uh, right after Thanksgiving. Um, so I just think it's really cool. I like it a lot. So this is $10, Come number here. 36. Come here. No, it's not a cheaper pot. Binksy. $10, number 36. Oh. <laughs> I Lily's, do have... Lily's mom. Lily's mom gets the this. I do have an enamel bedpan downstairs Ew, that I keep forgetting is down there, and I was going to put it in one of my sales. It's still in the original box. I know a lot of people use them as planters and stuff, so, you know. Binks is having one of his uh, woe is me moments. <laughs> you do what? You implant chickens in yours? What does that mean? Ow. Uh, Binks is digging into I do too. Implant chickens in mine. Oh, you plant hens and chickens? Dude, what are you? <laughs> Hi, Rebecca. How are ya? Hey. He doesn't want to be put down. Oh, that's cool. He's playing my bag. All right. So, next I have uh, this little Winnie the Pooh nightlight. 
brand new, still in the box. Hang on, guys. I'm going to show you how cute it is. Nope. I got it. Yeah. It slides. Yeah. No, stop. It, there's two layers. I know. I see it. All right. Hang on. Let me unplug this for a minute. Well, you got to give me a second. Don't, don't plug it back in. I know it's hard to see. Yeah, you can't tell because it's it's washed out. Yeah, that it helps a little bit. <laughs> but it is absolutely adorable. Let me unplug it. And this just slides right on. So let me put this back. I'm going to take the bulb out because I can't get it in the box with the bulb in there. I don't know how this goes in here, but here, I don't know how to put it in there. <laughs> so anyways, after some technical difficulties, uh, the Winnie the Pooh Nightlight is $12 and it's number five. $12, number five, for the Winnie the Pooh Nightlight. Oh, Elizabeth. Elizabeth Gove. You got it, Elizabeth. All right. All righty. Indigestion. All right. This, I just think, is so, so pretty. Do you want me to plug this back in? No. No? I don't need it anymore. Oh, okay. Um, it is a pottery piece, and I just think it's, it's really, really pretty. And it's this gorgeous picture. I love the blue, the color blue, and the way they did the flowers and the leaves. It's so pretty. It has an applied handle, as you can see. That's the maker on there, and it's very hard to read. But there's the handle. Isn't it gorgeous? I love it. There's the bottom. It's really, really pretty. And it is, oh, oh. Uh, would help if I had the ruler the right way. <laughs> it is uh, a little about seven and a quarter inches tall. So it's a beautiful piece. And uh, let me get the tag out so I could see how much it is. This is $12 and it's number 42. $12 number 42 for the picture. Linda. All right. Linda, you got it. I'll just put the tag right back in there. All right. Next up, I have a very cool uh, vintage cookbook from 1955. It is the woman's Home Companion Cookbook. Yes. And it has all kinds of, it has useful information about uh, different types of kitchen equipment. It has how to set a table and what they call the different um, settings in the, in the different pieces. It has all kinds of recipes. Uh, it's got like bread recipes, like uh, griddle cakes and waffles and uh, 
toasted breads, rich cruller twists, Melba toast. It's got fish and seafood, chicken. I have no idea what that is because it's in black and white. Oh, it's a, they're chicken leg core, half half chickens is what they are. Um, so how many half chickens are there? I don't know. It looks like four half chickens. Planked steak, beef kebabs, salads and dressings. Look at that. Ooh, color. Yes, color. So it's very cool. Um, so this is $8 and it's number 45. Hi, Gina. $8, number 45 for the 1955 cookbook. Oh, Susanna. Susanna. Hi, Susanna. What? Susanna. Susanna, when did you sneak in? Oh, this came out. All right. Uh, let me see. All right. I have an offer up. So these would make wonderful Christmas gifts. These are handmade. They've never been worn. I actually had them made for my daughter and she never wore them. And so I'm going to do them as an offer up. We have this homemade unicorn hat. <laughs> got the long ties look how cute that is oh my goodness how stinking cute is that so I have two hats I have this one we're going to do an offer up on each one or I could do them as a set then we have a cupcake one. How cute. Isn't that adorable? Did you, Elizabeth? I don't know how to, um, <laughs> he would disown you. <laughs> um, I just think that they're adorable. Sheila said a set. So, yeah. So, um, I could, I could do them as a set, as an offer up. So we will start them at um, $12. We'll start them at $12. I can't remember the girl that... Um, she got them from somebody on Etsy. Yeah, she has an Etsy shop, and I can't remember the name of the shop. I'll have to see if I can find it. But anyways, so we're going to start these at $12. All right, ready, everybody? Start. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> So there's that one. This one's cute. <laughs> I love them. So we're getting down to 20 seconds, everyone. 20 seconds. <laughs> Hi, Nate. I know the cupcake's adorable, too. <laughs> Five seconds. All right, stop. <laughs> so we're gonna refresh and see who got these. They're they're beautiful. They really are. All right. So the highest was 21, but the first person who typed 21 is doggone happy vintage and antiques, right? Uh, yes. So, yes. So, Jane, 
You are the winner of the hats. Thank you so much, honey. They're a uh, new house. Yeah. All right. Way to go there, Jane. All righty. Uh, let's see. Jessica has some stuff today, too. So I'm going to do a few more items. And then I'll have Jessica do her stuff. I almost feel like, should we just turn the camera around to me? Because the table's here. Yeah, we could. And it would just be harder to try yeah. and bring everything over that way. All right. Next up, I have um, something that is not vintage whatsoever. It's just cool. And I just thought of um, Elderly Poodle when I seen it. So uh, it's this little poodle dog. He's uh, like resin, I guess you would say. Oh, there's po um, Poodle. <laughs> Hi, Poodle. You must have heard, you must have knew I was going to show this. He's just resin, but he's just really cool, I think. I couldn't help myself. I had to get it. So I'm just, he, I'm offering him for $6, number 30. $6, number 30. <laughs> Carrie. Yeah, K-C-A-T-X. All right, you got it, Carrie. K-C-A-T-X. All right. Um... I have some, uh, a couple pieces of, a few pieces of milk glass today. Um, up next is this gorgeous set of um, hobnail. Hi, Laura. Hobnail salt and pepper shakers. They are Fenton. They have Fenton on the bottom. So uh, they are in really, really good condition. Poodle said she can't buy herself poodles until after Christmas. Oh, come on, Poodle. What if somebody else buys them? Paula said she has those. Oh, do you? <laughs> Wait a minute. Carrie just said. Uh... Oh, we, I, yeah. You can't say nothing about, never mind. Yeah, we can do that, Carrie. <laughs> We can do that. Absolutely. Um, yeah, so these are beautiful. Like, look at the bottoms. So these are $10, and they're number 26. $10, number 26 for the Fenton Salt and Peppers. Vintage Thrifted Shrimp. Oh, that's Laura. Laura what? Melendez. Laura Melendez. Thank you, Laura. All right. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. One more um, milk glass piece. It's this cute little, you could use this as a little sugar bowl. Um, I'm using it as a little honey pot. You could use it however you would like. You could use it for mustard, mayonnaise, um, whatever you would like. There's no markings on it. But it's really very cute. There's no cracks, no chips. That's the top. Paula, darn, I have that too. Paula, what don't you have, my friend? <laughs> this is $6, number 33. <laughs> Dollars number 33. Vintage thrifted treasures. All right, Laura, you got it, honey. <laughs> All right. Oh, dear. Again? Oh, dear. Again? What do you want, Ken? Well, Paula, I am going to be thinning out my hobnail collection very soon. So just throwing that out there for you. Um, let me see. Let me do a couple more. Okay, I'm going to do this. Um, I'm trying to see. No, I'll just do this. Let me get this out of the way. 
All right. Well, this will be perfect for Christmas. Um, it's Alex at Chapter 2 Vintage Co. Dude, come on. Irene. Her channel is Chapter 2. There she is. <laughs> I have this beautiful emerald green anchor hocking. I'm assuming it's either a planter or you could use it as a candy dish. You could put some beautiful um, Christmas bulbs in here. Uh, whatever you would like. It's really, it's a gorgeous color. I love the swirl pattern. It's very pretty. It is um, five and a half inches around. So this is going to be $10 and it's number 46. $10, number 46. Hi, sis. Linda. Uh, no. On my end, I have Linda. Oh, I have Cheryl. I don't even see Linda. The refresh and just see what happens. That's really weird because I have... Hang on, guys. Yeah, Linda. Yeah, Linda. Well, how come she's not showing up on mine? Well, that was like how it was when we were trying to do that giveaway okay. thing. All right, Linda, you got it, honey. Yeah, uh, Linda. Uh, yes, Elizabeth, I did see you, but you were just farther down the line. Yeah. All right. All right. So that was. Are you in live chat? Uh, let me see. Okay, I just went to, you know what? I've never done that. I have never made sure I was in live chat. I thought it automatically is no, live man, chat when you. you uh oh. Oh. Hang on, guys. Nancy, why must you be everywhere? <laughs> oh my goodness I still Jesus. don't have I still don't show Linda oh, I so I don't know where she disappeared to but whatever <laughs> alright um, let me see alright I think this is an awesome item you guys and I love it I just don't deck, you know, have this kind of decor because I don't live there in the tropical. But look at this, you guys. It doesn't have to be a tropical. Tell me this is not awesome. Who doesn't want a wooden pelican standing on the dock? <laughs> I think it is totally awesome. Look at his feet. How cool is that? Isn't it awesome? I love it. It's got felt on the bottom. Exactly. I, when I saw this, the first person I thought of was Alex and then um, Blue, Flamingo. Uh, Blue Flamingo. I mean... It is just awesome. I love it. This is $15 and it's number 25. $15, number 25. ATX. Okay, I'm seeing different people, so I'm just not going to say anything. All right, can somebody just verify that it's KCATX? Cause she can't. Yeah, my my phone my phone is screwy. Yeah, Casey. All right, thank you. I'm in live chat, so I don't understand All it. Right, so it's number twenty five, okay. and we have Casey. So and that that's Carrie, and Lori is her mother. So Lori. she's buying. 
Blue Flamurk oh. is Lori. Oh. And Carrie is her daughter. Yes. <laughs> All right. So, um, should I, how much? I'm going to do a couple more pieces because she has quite a few things. So, let me just do a couple more and, um. All right, I have this really cute bamboo planter. It's got the cute little elephant. Look at his little butt. Look at his little bum. <laughs> He's hugging on that vase. How cute is that? Look at, there's two elephant butts on there. <laughs> Isn't that adorable? Oh my goodness. I don't know where his tail is. He's they're both tailless elephants. But they are adorable. No cracks, no chips. <laughs> Eight dollars number twenty-nine. Eight dollars number twenty-nine. <laughs> He's All a cutie. Right. I got Joyce Myers. Joyce Myers. You got the tailless elephants. All right. Um, all right. This is my last um, little bit of milk glass. I have a... I can't exit out of the chat, I don't think. Let me see. No, no I can, I think. Stop. Yeah, I'm, I'm afraid I don't want to screw it up. No, don't do... Yeah, I'm not going to mess with it, guys. I'm just going to go back in live chat and call it a day. Okay. Next, I have a set of three milk glass plates with the, um, the, the, what do they call that? The lace, lace edging. So we have something sticky on this one. Ew. Uh, I don't know what the heck that is. But anyways, we have the uh, pear and the grapes. Yes, but in the milk glass, they call it um, like a lace edge. Then we have, looks to me like maybe a peach and some like grapes or raspberries. Then I have this one with a peach and a I think it's a pear, pear. and an apple. Well, a pear, an apple, a peach, whatever. Right, they're very pretty. There's no cracks, no chips on any of them. Some sticky residue on one. Right. There's some sticky stuff on this one. I don't even know what the heck it is, but I'll make sure I clean it off. Um, so you get the set of three for $16, number 11. $16, number 11 for the set of three. Elizabeth Gove. Elizabeth. Sis said, I love this, but I have no room for them. My kitchen already looks like one of Dee's thrift hauls. <laughs> Sis. <laughs> All right. Um, I think I'll do this real quick. And then I'm going to turn the camera over to Jessica. I'm going to switch seats, I think. Um, wow, I, I showed this a couple hauls ago, and it is this beautiful blue floral vase with a like a mother of pearl finish over it. It's just gorgeous. Now there is a chip here, which I did touch up with some um, watercolors. But it is really, really pretty. And it is... So beach about. Six inches tall. 
Oh, Lord. These cats are about to make oh, me lose my down. marbles. I love when his tail gets all fat and Why fluffy. is it all fat and fluffy? Because Sophie freaking tweaked out, so then he freaked out. <laughs> God. <laughs> it's like a zoo in here today. Get down. Go on. So, anyways, this is going to be $10, and it's number six. $10, number six. <laughs> Elizabeth. All right, Elizabeth. You got it. All right, so I am going to turn the camera around and let Jessica do her thing. There's that. There's this. Okay. Well, no, I'm actually, just going to do this. Oh. There. Oh, I can't, but I can't see if oh, I'm you holding can't it or not. Well, I guess I kind of can. Hold on. Well, here, just turn it around. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Here, 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 here. It's fine. Here. Hello. There you go. <laughs> All right. Sorry, Hello. guys. Didn't mean to make you dizzy. Um, I have quite a few things today, but it's kind of like a random assortment of things. Um, I have several craft bags, which I'm going to start with. Uh, the first one is a lot of loose glitters. Uh, most of them have never been used. A couple of them did, but they're the big bottles, so you, I mean, you can't really tell that too much was missing. So I have two really big ones. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of these ones, all different colors. Silver, green, a dark green, like a rose gold color. Um, I have red, kind of like a pinky color, and gold and blue. Oh, well, that didn't help. No, okay. Gold, red, pink, blue. And then I also have um, a bunch of some loose, like, confetti. So we have confetti pieces. We have a couple Halloween ones, some holographic stars. So for the glitter lot, it's going to be $10, and it is letter G for glitter. Shirley Pearl, what did you sneak in? Hello. <laughs> All right, glitter lot, done. Shirley Pearl is the winner. Next lot that I have is a tape lot. Hi, Sharon. Um, I have several unused washi tapes and tapes. Um, so there's this one. There's this one. These ones are Scotch brand. Uh, this one, it's like a florally print. I also have this one, like a blue geometric. Uh, this one's kind of like abstracty, and I have a couple that are from Hobby Lobby. This one started peeling back a little bit just because it's a a glittered tape, and then we also have this one, which is like a little garland. I also have three rolls rolls of this. It is a clear tape but it's meant to look like lace I have um, this pink stripedy one and some unicorn duct tape so for the tape lot it is eight dollars and like I said you do get three of those clear lace rolls and it is letter T for tape Shirley, I'm glad you like them. Judy Reardon gets the the tape lot. All right. Thank you, Judy. Next craft lot is a bunch of kind of like cardboardy esque things. So I have several packages of new unopened little name tags. I love using these for like um, Christmas packages with the twine. So like I said, there's five of these and there's 10 per pack. Um, there's also some cardboard cutout letters. So a lot of this would be good for scrapbooking. We have some pink metallic. We also have some black glitter ones. 
Um, also, I guess I kind of threw in some, uh, oh, mom, would these buttons be good for? Yes. Okay. So aside from these big round buttons, because we're going to take them out and give them to who? Uh, Maria, California thrifter, because she makes the hats yeah. for the cancer patients. So aside from the big, like, solid color buttons, there is some Monsters, Inc. little character uh, buttons that you can sew onto something. I also have a pack of strawberry buttons. We have some banners, new in package. We also have some more cardboard letters and we do have some other cutouts like Nikki's glove, things like that. We have some popsicle sticks, more name tags, some little um, clothespins and some wooden dowels. So this is like the cardboard wood bag. Oh, feathers, did I show you feathers? There's feathers in here too, it's a random assortment. So this is $12, letter S. $12, letter S. Uh. Okay, right. so Laura got that one because Elaine, it was letter S as in Sam. Oh, I'm sorry. Not letter X. So I'm very sorry. We should have probably... Um, Specified letter S as in Sam. Sam. Sorry about that. Usually I do. All uh, right. Okay, so wait, I'm trying to find it. Ribbon lot, glitter lot. Scrapbook is what I have it labeled oh, okay. as. Just um, fix that. It was what? Eight? Twelve. Oh, twelve. Twelve dollars. Okay, and it was Laura. And then the last craft lot that I have is a ribbon lot. Um, several of these have been unopened. Some of them I used a little piece from, like this one is brand new. It's like a pink one. Um, this one I used a small piece from. Originally a lot of these ribbon, I was gonna try and make Disney ears, but didn't happen. Um, I also have a thick green one, which is why a lot of them are kind of the thicker one. A blue one. I also have another blue skinnier one. Do I have to know if they're wired? Uh, no. No, no. None of them are wired. Sorry about that. And I also have these ones. Some black ones. Quite a few different ones. And then I'll also put in some remnants as well. Um, a glittery orange one. And then here's a headband that I also bought for to make the ears. So there's that. So for this lot, it is going to be, uh, I don't know where my thing $12. is. Oh, I found it. $12 and it is letter R as in ribbon. Judy Reardon. All right. So the craft ones are done. Those were the ones that were going to take the most time just because I was trying to show you guys what was in there. All right. Next, Hi, butterfly nurse. next item, I'm pretty positive. It's about 18 by 18. It's a square. It's a pillowcase. And it says, we'll be friends forever now, won't we, Pooh? And Pooh says even longer. So you can just get one of those plain pillows from Hobby Lobby and then, or Joanne Fabrics, and the zipper to stuff it. Um, I don't know what this is. Mom, I need the paper. Oh, what is it? The pillowcase. Uh, let me see. <laughs> I can't find it. Winnie the Pooh pillowcase. This is $8 and it is letter X as in xylophone. <laughs> and like I said, it's an 18-ish by 18-ish square. 
Fine eight. Helen Casey. Helen Casey, you get the pillowcase. Oh, there it is. Continuing okay. on with the uh, bedding, we have another wall tapestry blanket. This one is the 100 acre wood map. And again, this one's new. This says that it was manufactured in America. So it's just one of those long blankets. This is $20. And it is letter M, as in Mary. Okay. Next item was one that I tried for last week, and we're going to try it again. Elizabeth got the tapestry. Okay. This is the Green Alien Crew Neck Sweater, brand new with tags from Box Lunch. It is a size large, um, size large unisex, sorry, trying to uh, deter binks. Okay, this I was asking $20 for, and I don't know what the letter is, Mother. Uh, let me see here. It should be towards the bottom. It is letter A as an apple. $20 A as an apple. Originally retailed for... J is for Jack's Cinnamon Toasty Apple Jack's. <laughs> Originally retailed for $45. Elizabeth Gove. Okay. Uh, next item is a extra large Hello Binks is a extra large tote bag. I can take it out of the plastic, but I just wanted to at least show you that it was brand new in the plastic before I took it out, just so that way you can see the size. It is like a weekender bag, they call it, a weekender duffel. So it's quite large. It has two straps. You could do the shoulder strap or they have the little um, wrist straps. It is a navy and like a cream canvas. This is $14 and it is letter B as in bag. $14 B as in bag. Elizabeth, you got it. All right, wow, Binks. Sorry, now I have to move because uh, I cleared everything in this area. <laughs> Hi, Banksy. You're sitting so nice, too. I'm sorry. Oh, dear. All right, I have a few mugs. This one is a Tervis travel mug. It has Winnie the Pooh and Piglet. The quote is, busy doing nothing. The Tervis ones are a hot and a cold. It gives you all your care things in here. Uh, this is $10, and it is letter P for Pooh and Piglet. <clears throat> the next mug that I have... Are you good? Helen Casey. The next mug that I have is an old Disney store one, and you can tell it's old because of this logo here. Oh, no, my wanna... God. <laughs> oh, Lord. I just want to re uh, say that Helen Casey got the uh, poo cup. The tumbler. The tumbler, yes. All right. So we have this brown poo mug. And it's got some kind of sketches. Sorry, the light glare isn't really helping it. But for the Pooh mug, it is $6. And it's a pretty deep mug. And it is letter N, as in Nancy. $6 N for Nancy. Uh, Judy Reardon. The next tumbler that I have it was actually... Um, from a, honestly, I, I don't know 
the actual creator themselves because I'm pretty sure I got it from one of the Disney subscription boxes, but I know it's like a small business who makes them. So it is like the glittered resin thing that they do with mugs and it's an aluminum tumbler mug. This one is $14 because it's quite a bit larger than the other one. And it is letter I for Monsters Incorporated. So you have Mike and Sully. Elizabeth. Got uh, fast internet today, Elizabeth. <laughs> this was purchased from a Japanese store in the Disney parks. It is this little rice bowl. So it's like a little rabbit with some strawberries and it has a really, really cute little border. And it was made in Japan. It was from a store called Mitsukoshi. So it's a glass bowl. Um, it is $5. And it is letter H, as in ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Annie P. The last, um, hi Annie. <laughs> the last mug that I have is a little bit dusty because it's been on the shelf yeah. for display. Um, is this Stitch Sum Sum mug. Sum Sums were a big thing. Um, several years ago. And again, this is the um, old older logo. Hi, Clay. This is $6 and it is letter Y as in yo. Yo-yo. Yo-yo? Is it on here? I don't think so because okay. I just pulled it off the shelf because we All were right. sick of looking at it. <laughs> All right. Okay, that goes to Annie P. I have a couple of jewelry items. How much was it, Jess? Six dollars. Oh. I have a couple of jewelry items. Um, I did sell the Disney Alex and Ani last week. And I just so happened to be going through and cleaning things out. And I realized that I had some other Alex and Ani bracelets that were never worn. Dude, why? Binks. No, no. Stop. No, no. Um, so they were never worn. So the first one, and I also have the cards to go with it as well. So here's the cards that explain um, what the symbol means and all of that. So the first one that I have is called the Seven Swords one. And it looks like this. And um, this one is actually a biblical one. Uh, the seven swords represent the seven archangels. Michael, I'm, I'm going to butcher these. So this, the seven archangels. Uh, theirs is a world of love symbolized by a radiant flame. Wear this charm to experience their higher power for love for yourself. So again, brand new, never worn. This is $20. And it is letter, they're at the end, Mom. Letter L for love. Bye, Laura. Thank you. Judy Reardon. That was the wrong one, I think. No. Yes. Well, there, oh, there's three of them. Oh, okay. Well, then we'll fine. just change the yeah. letter. Okay. So we'll, uh, where is that one? Right here. Oh, wow. Sorry, guys. So just switch it. The one okay, that says so, sword. Yeah. All right, hang on. Um, so this one will be. Let me see it for a second. This one is L then, right? And then this one will be. Okay. Okay. All right, let me write down. I said Judy Reardon, right? Yeah. yeah. The next one that I have is one that actually my mom got for me, but I, again, Never wore it, so perhaps somebody else would enjoy it. Um, it is the one that just says daughter, and it has a daisy. Ma, you probably totally forgot about this until right this second. Wow! <laughs> I'm sorry, I never wore it. 
But anyways, so uh, it says daughter, and it is blessings, friend, and possibility, and it's got the little blurb on the back. Thank you, Susanna. <laughs> Again, $20 uh, letter. O as in octopus. Randy Heilman. So this one, I believe I wore it once, so it doesn't have the tag on it. Um, and this is the card that came with this one. It's the Evolution of the Heart Collection, so it just looks like this. And it just says love. And this one is, um, like, you put it on a little bit differently. So since this one doesn't have the tag on it, um, I'm asking 15 for it. And it is letter F, as in Frank. That's a pretty one. Mm -hmm. It's got the different colored beads and stuff. Shirley Pearl. Shirley. And one more that also doesn't have the tag, but again, I recall only maybe wearing this once. This one is in gold, and it is the pineapple one. So for anyone who likes tropical-y things, the pineapple means welcome, warmth, and friendship, and then the blurb on the back. So again, because it um, isn't doesn't have the exact tag on it, I'm asking 15. And it is letter E as in Eeyore, or elderly poodle. <laughs> Susan Cole. So, Poodle, that's just a regular shelf that I hung up above my stove. I bought the shelf um, probably at a thrift store and just hung it up above my stove. So, there you go. Um, I have... Hold on. Oh. Cheryl, I, that's my brand new stove right there. I just got it yesterday. And um, one of... The <laughs> One of the the uh, grates was cracked, <laughs> so they have to send me a new one. But yeah, I love it. It's so cool. Uh, last glassware set is a two-piece mug set. Brand new in the box. Um, this was also from a subscription box that I have, but again, I never use them. So this would be nice for um, a gift for somebody. So there's this mug. They're very similar in design, just different colors. And then um, the person who actually designed these are a local artist from Florida. They kind of look like a wood grain design. So for the two pair, well, the pair of mugs, it is $12 and it is letter K as in uh, Krispy Kreme Donuts. <laughs> Susan Cole. So I just got to find it. Mm. Oh, two pairs of mugs. Yeah, yeah. Okay, Susan Cole. All right. I have a card set for you guys. Um, the actual deck of cards is from Walt Disney World. It has Stitch as the Jokers, which is the only reason why I bought it, because I was a huge Stitch fan. Oh, my God, you guys. Donuts are my favorite. You're killing me. And um, this is the image on the back of the card. It kind of looks like a vintage postcard of Walt Disney World. And it comes in, like, the little acrylic case. And then the other set of cards in this set is a pack of Disney Uno the, well, Disney Princess Uno. And this was played maybe once or twice, if I remember correctly. So for the set of cards, we have the Uno set and the deck of cards. It is $8 and is letter U for Uno. Definitely nice stacking stuffers. Carmen! Carmen Zermino, you got the wrong letter, Carmen. <laughs> Cindy's thrifting again. 
You got it, Cindy. I'm sorry, Carmen. It's okay. We have one more set of cards that if y'all want. This one comes in a tin. So there's two decks. One is a villain's deck and one is kind of like the cute and the cuddly character's deck. So this is the front of the tin. There's the two decks and the back. So again, this was these were only played with a handful of times and have just been sitting in my desk. So each one, the characters are different. So we have Peter, Jiminy, Lady. Um, so these ones are kind of like the nice fun characters, Dalmatian puppies. And then the villains ones are obviously the villains, which I will show you in one minute. These ones are kind of fun. <clears throat> Isn't he so obnoxious right now? Bubbies. So the Joker, we have the Cheshire Cat, Queen of Hearts, Maleficent, just randomly picking Scar. So a huge assortment. So you get both of the decks in the tin for $10 and it is letter uh, I think that's a D. Yes. Letter D for Disney. And just bear with me. Susan Cole. While I put these back in their boxes. Maybe. Um, I have a board game, which again, I, I was only played maybe once or twice. I had this issue um with buying it because i didn't have it and um hold on a second carmen um cindy said that if you would like those cards you can have them so if you let me know if you would like them cindy said she'll give them to you Chugging on. Um, okay, so thank you, Cindy. Carmen will take the cards. Thank you very much. Sharing Let is me, um, caring. Sharing is caring, right. Carmen. I have a, like I said, maybe played it once. We have a Pictopia game. Thank you, Cindy. And all the pieces are there, like I said. Instructions, board, all the things. So the board game is, <laughs> I know the things on here, I just don't know what I did with it. Carry. <laughs> all right, so Pictopia is $10 and it is letter J for Jessica. Susan Cole gets the Pictopia game. Where is it? I just saw it. Um, last lot, and then I have one more item, is a lot of Disney coloring books. So again, stocking stuffers. Well, there's four Disney ones and one adult one. So the adult one is a mermaid one. that you would, you know, really want to take your time on because they're very intricate. Oh, look, it's a pregnant mermaid. A pregnant mermaid? Yeah. <laughs> look. So yeah, these ones are really uh. intricate. So we have a mermaid. And then we also have this one, which is Playtime Giggles for kids. Oh, gotta get that. All different movies, Pixar characters. Oh, is that Remy? Oh, no, it's Toy Story. Then we also have a Walt Disney World one. All different characters again. And two different Disney on Ice ones, because I've attended several of those. And some more. Ugh. 
So for the four coloring books, five coloring books, one, two, three, four, five, five coloring books, it is $6 and it is letter Z for Carmen Zermino. <laughs> Judy Reardon. And the last item that I have is an item that unfortunately had to be passed on last week. Oh dear. She can't reach it, so she's gotta get up. Yeah, the person that um, won the item was not able to complete her order, so. Um, but she let us know, which we very right. much appreciate. Yep, she let us know that something came up, so. We're just going to re-offer it. It is the Poo Clock again. Comes with the glass dome. I will take out the batteries before shipping. All right. Poo Clock again. $15 letter C as in cat. <gasps> or clock. Yeah, that too. <laughs> Kathy Morrison. All right. That's all for me. Thank you very much. I'm going to move these pretty briskly because I've taken up the whole table now. And I'm, I'm um, all right. Yeah, you're live, Elizabeth. Thank you guys very much. I'm going to swivel now. So sorry if you get dizzy. Oh, yes. You just All right. Sorry, it. guys. Just give me a <laughs> second to uh, catch up now. All right. Whoops. Hi. All righty. So I am back now, and I still have a lot of stuff here. So I have to get moving. Wow, 323 people. Yay. But I only have 140 thumbs up. Everybody says thank you, Jessica. Thank you. <laughs> All right. So, let me see what I have next. I sold one of these before, and I did find another one, and it's I just think they're so cute. Um, this is, of course, a nut dish <laughs> with the little squirrel on top. These seem to be very popular. There's no cracks and no chips anywhere. It does have a little piece of clay that's like stuck on there. Um, and I believe these are made in Japan. But yeah, it is just adorable and it's good size. He's a little cutie. <laughs> so he's going to be $12, number two. $12, number two. Linda. Linda. You got it, Linda. He actually has part of a sticker on his tail. So I just noticed that. All right, next I have, yes, she is, Annie. Well, uh, Christmas Eve. Annie P. said, aren't you getting married in uh, about five weeks? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. They actually, um, her and her fiance. Uh, don't put it in. Nope, nope. Oh, she won't let me say. Never mind. She doesn't want to jinx anything, so. Okay. So next I have this beautiful little trinket dish. I, at first I thought it was soapstone, but um, someone said that it's not. They said what it is, and I don't remember what it is, but it's just beautiful. So this is going to be $8, and it's number 27. $8, number 27 for the pretty trinket dish. It almost reminds me of slag glass, but it's not slag glass. Alicite? 
A-L-A-C-I-T-E. Alicite. Oh, okay. Incole. Elizabeth. Okay, Elizabeth. You got it. Virginia, you are not invisible. What do you mean you're invisible? She said, I am invisible. No, you're not. Sometimes I wish I was invisible. Oh, sorry. If you can see this, hit the like key. I've been running back and forth trying to put stuff away, so I, I'm not really paying attention to the chat. Oh, yeah, minute. that's why. That's why, Virginia, she's putting the stuff that's sold back in the other room so we don't have to do it all at the end of the sale. Sorry. Um, okay. All right. Next I have this amazing olive green. Uh, it's like uh, erased circles, like bubbles. So, so pretty. Now, it does have an issue down here on the bottom. I don't know if you can, let me do it this way. See if you can see it. Where is it? Now I can't find it. Oh, hang on. Oh, there it is. I had my finger over it. <laughs> it has like, um, it's like a, it's a, a crack, but it's a surface crack. It doesn't go all the way through or anything like that. It's almost it's almost like a a deep scratch, I would say. So, and I mean, it's not going to like the the pedestal's not going to fall off or anything like that by any means. And this is just a gorgeous piece. It is, let me see how tall it is. Let me see this pen. Pardon me for a second. It is 10 and a half inches tall. So it's just a beautiful, um, I don't know if it's Empoli or not, um, Cindy, but it is just gorgeous. This is $16, number 24. $16, number 24. I know, it's very pretty. Well, right. I like this color. I'm making my way. Susan Cole, I believe. Yes. Okay, you got it, Susan. Put it over there. Um, I think we need to do an offer up. Time for an offer up. Oh, I've been sitting far too long and I forgot to put my pillow on the chair this time. All right, <clears throat> these are amazing, I think. And they are not Dorothy Thorpe, but they are Dorothy Thorpe-like. <laughs> they're like Dorothy Thorpe, but they're not. And I have two sets of these. And the amazing carrier, I need a checklist before my sales, I know. So, there are two of these. And I am doing an offer up. Uh, I'm doing it as a set. So it'll be 12 glasses and the two carriers, okay? So as I said, it's 12 glasses and the two carriers. This is what the glasses look like. The glasses are five and a quarter inches tall and they are all in really great condition. Um, I don't really see any issues on any of them. Um, no chips that I am aware of. I mean, I checked them all when I bought them, and it was quite a long while ago. So, all right. 
Let me get my time clock ready here. <clears throat> All right. We are going to start the offers at $15 for the two sets. Ready, start. They're beautiful. Uh-oh, I know Elaine wants these for her brother for Christmas, huh, Elaine? Yep, both sets. They are beautiful. They're very dusty, though, because they've been sitting in my eBay room for a while. 30 seconds left. 30 seconds left. Twenty seconds left. Oh, ten seconds. My shoulder is killing me, but thank you for asking. Stop. Yeah, I'm, it's not going to be too much longer before I'm going to end up having to have surgery, unfortunately. All right, let's see who got these. Were we re little refreshed? Judy Reardon, 25. Judy Reardon, you got the sets, the two sets for $25. That is a steal. That is a steal and a half. Congratulations, Judy. All right. You're welcome, Judy. <clears throat> All right. Next, I have this adorable little honey pot. It's absolutely, it's just so cute. It's got the little bees. It's got a flower on the top and then the little the little doohickey thing <laughs> has a little bee on top. Look at that. <laughs> so cute. So this cute little honey server or whatever it's called is $10 number 12. $10, number 12. That ain't right. No? Mm -hmm. That is <clears throat> that. Oh, so maybe I got them mixed up. Well, I don't know what to look for. Well, hold on. A honey jar? Honey pot. Honey pot? Yeah. Okay, so who won the honey pot? Um, it was Elizabeth. Okay, it's only $8, not 10 I had the wrong tag. Sorry. The tag is inside because I'm, I'm... Well, double check and make sure. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Number 49, $8. Well, you said that now I was going to switch it with that. Oh, well, then we'll just do something different with that one. <laughs> so, there you go. It was $8. All right. So, okay. So you want to just keep it as that number and just use that for that still? Or you want to switch that this number, that number? We'll switch this number. All right. So then I'm just going to put this here. Let's go off that. And Sorry, this, guys. It's going to be something else. All right. So that'll be... Um, the next one? Yeah. Okay. So next I have, and I don't know why I have tissue paper in here, but it is this hanging grape. Um, I don't know if this is like a pomodoro. Air plant hanger. Or yeah, you could put air plants in there. Full plants. Be perfect in a kitchen. I just thought it was really cool. It's $10 and it's number 57. $10, number 57. Isn't it cute? 
Elaine Wallace. Elaine Wallace. All right. Okay, anybody there from Nashville, Tennessee? I got this awesome Nashville, Tennessee ashtray. It's in the uh, Mother of Pearl uh, finish on there. Very, very cool piece. This rim is actually purple. I love it. It does have some kind of sticker on the back, but it was um, from water. It got water damage. But, uh, yeah, it's just a really cool uh, souvenir piece. This is $6, and it's number 34. $6, number 34 from the Nashville Ashtray. I just thought I would give it a try. Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Okay. Okay. Now I bought this and because I had a plate that I thought it would go with, and now I can't find the plate. Uh, so I'm just going to sell this. It is a beautiful, this is from Bavaria. It is this beautiful cup with acorns and leaves on it. I love the colors in this cup. Really, really pretty. Um, it's got flowers and uh, stuff on the inside. Nice and clean. There's the signature. It's hand painted. It is. It's beautiful. So this is $8 and it's number 50. Eight dollars, number fifty. Number fifty. Perfect for fall. <laughs> Linda, I believe Dickerhoff. Yes. You got it, Linda. Linda, Linda. All right. We're getting down there, guys. Nope, you still got all this stuff on the chair, homie. No, that's. Oh my God. <laughs> OMG. I forgot, you guys. I have linens. So, hold on. Wow, this sale's going to go three hours again. Holy cow. All right. Uh, you know what? I'm, I'm doing uh, another offer up, guys. I have a gorgeous afghan that I want to show you. Sorry, Banksy. Look at this afghan. Is it not beautiful? It has fringe. The two two different color fringe. This is in perfect condition. That I didn't see any poles or anything on it. I washed it. It smells so good. It's beautiful. I don't know what the stitch is here, but it's like, it um, like it's kind of puffy. So we're going to start the offer up on this afghan at $15. Bye, Poodle. Thanks for coming. So the starting, um, I don't know what size. It's big. I didn't measure it. Shame on me. Um, it's big. It's big. Probably fits like a full-size bed, I would say. It's definitely bigger than twin. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, it's it's very big. Um, I It's knitted. Yeah, I don't know. It's knitted, not crocheted. That's what Judy says. Yeah. So, um, but it's it's really, it's big. Like. That might be a queen size. This then. might even be like a queen size. Because this is, yeah, it's it's wide and it's long. 
I'm sorry I didn't measure it, but it is but very it is large. Huge. <laughs> it's huge. All right, we are going to start at $15. Ready? Go. <laughs> it is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous, and it's so thick. It's beautiful. All right. Got about 30 seconds, guys. Let's see if I can stand up and... She a big one. Yeah, it's big. All right, 15 seconds. I didn't see. All right, guys. Got getting down to the nitty gritty. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. We are refreshing. I got. Let me just scroll up a bit. Make sure. Sue Golombeski. Sue Golombeski. $51. Congratulations. This is absolutely gorgeous. You are going to love this. It's beautiful. Um, did you not have this on here? It's an offer up. Handmade hats, the bowl, ballet box, my hand glass bowl. Is it on the next page? Uh, hang on guys it's number eight offer up the offer ups are sporadically uh, throughout well, yeah up. okay so if that was number eight sue just so you know yeah sorry I, that's i'm try i was trying to do it you know okay. so this All right, so this is also um, number four. This is an offer up. Oh, okay. I have another offer up. So I have this bag of handmade. Um, Are those baby shoes? Um, Crochet? <laughs> Pot holders. Pot holders, that's it. <laughs> Handmade pot holders, and I don't know what these are for unless they're pin cushions. I think they're pin cushions. Oh. But included in in with the pot holders is this set. It is the two little shoes and the dress. So I'm, I'm not quite sure what the purpose is of the shoes unless, as I said, they are little pin cushions. So, but also in the bag, you are getting, this is a pin cushion, I know that. It's a little hat, right? Yeah, but it's a pin cushion. Mm -hmm. Then we have this pot holder, oh, nice. which is a, a peach color and cream. I've had them. Oh. We have yellow. We have this really pretty one. I love this one. We have this pretty green. This one. And these two. That one's got a stain on it. Where? Oh, it's got, this one has a little stain on the bottom, but it might come out. I haven't washed these. There and there. Yeah, so, so you will be putting your offers in for the whole bag of. The whole kit and caboodle. That's right. The whole kit and caboodle. So we are going to start offers on these beautiful handmade items at $10. 
Okay, everybody, oh, ready? Wait, not, Jessica's not ready? Oh, Jessica's not ready. Hang on. <laughs> All right. Ready? Start. Ten dollars. These are gorgeous. <laughs> I just love these little booties in the dress. A good kitten caboodle, huh, Mama J? <laughs> I think so. I mean, they're just gorgeous. I wish I knew how to make this kind of stuff, but I don't. Never really learned how to do that. Okay, got 20 seconds left. These are so pretty. Look at how pretty. All right. Ten seconds, everyone. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. All right. Let's see who the winner is. Jill Mozina, $39. Oh, Jill Mozina, you are the winner of these beautiful handmade items. Thank you, Jill. Okay. All right. Okay, next I have this very cool. To me, I believe it is like an apple cider dispenser is what I'm thinking it is. It's got the little spigot on the bottom. There's crazing. There's crazing. On the front. Yeah, there's some crazing on the front, as you could see here. It is just beautiful. I think it's awesome. There's no cracks or chips. That's the lid. Um, as I said, very clean inside. I don't know if anybody even used it. This is $15 and it's number 41. $15, number 41 for the apple cider dispenser. Isn't it cool? Even if you just... Use it for decoration. Oh, Pat. That's my apple girl right there. <laughs> All right, Pat. You got it. All right. Thumbs up, guys. There's 308 people. Let me get a thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> and if you're here and you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. All right. Oh, here he comes. Oh, dear. Here comes the Binks. Do, 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 do. He's back again. <gasps> that was you. You I scared know. me. <laughs> I hurt my leg. Okay. Um, I just thought I would put this out there. This is the, the little car planter that I um, repaired. If you remember, it was missing this corner of the windshield. And I did the best I could with uh, the clay, but you wouldn't really see it if you had it sitting this way. But I think I did a pretty okay job. I think it came out all right. It does have a little chip here, which I could touch up with some uh, watercolors. Thank you, Gina. So this little, um, this little car planter, uh, is going to be $12, and it's number 16. $12, number 16. Thank you. Jeffrey Ross. Jeffrey. Um, and also, I know I mentioned it in my last video. It does have some other, um, like, hairline cracks in here. Thanks, Jeffrey. All right. Next, I have this very cool um, mid-century modern uh, covered casserole dish. Hi, Jen Bootsy. How are you? 
I think this is so cool. <laughs> I can't take this cat anymore today. Um, so this is the lid. Let me set this down. There's the lid. No cracks, no chips anywhere. Nope. And um, there is what's left of the mark on the bottom. I don't know if it said Japan or what, but it's long gone now, but it's nice and clean. This is an awesome uh, casserole. If this doesn't sell, I wouldn't mind keeping it, actually. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. <laughs> This is $12, number 15. $12, number 15. Jeffrey. Jeffrey, you got it. All right. I have, <clears throat> excuse me, one piece of uranium glass. Now, this was actually, uh, actually originally came with um, a lid. Uh, the lid is long gone. But it is, uh, it, I believe it was like a refrigerator dish. And it did, as I said, did at one time come with a lid. Um, and how do I know this? Because I found one with the lid um, and I sold it like quite a while ago. Um, I was using this in my bathroom to hold, you know, like, cos not cosmetics, but, you know, um, what do you call it? Cotton balls. Essentials, you know, whatever. Toothpaste. Yeah, all kinds of little essentials. So it does have some, like, little flea bites, very tiny little flea bites over here. And it does glow. It does have flea bites. There we are. Wait. There we are. Oh, yay. <laughs> All right. So, um, yeah, so it does have little flea bites going along the top edge in certain spots. Uh, but other than that, there's like no major cracks or major chips or anything. So, um, and this is good size. This is eight inches long by six inches wide and it is three and a half inches tall so this is going to be sixteen dollars and it's number 18 sixteen dollars number 18 christy garza i believe uh Christy Garza. Christy Garza. You got it. Would it uh, that was the wrong number. Huh? That was the wrong number. It's number 18. Yeah, it was wrong. Oh, okay. Uh, now I gotta find this. I don't understand how that happens. It should be under uranium. Legendary green apron, teapot, Dutch tablecloth, fall placemat, nut bowl, set, Pyrex set. All correct. That's it. It's not on here. Okay. Well, that'll be number 58 then, Christy. Just so you know. It'll be number 58. Oh, you want to know why? Oh, there it is. That's why. Oh, dang it. Well, my bad. I put the wrong, I put the so wrong actually, tag. Actually, it's 53, Christy. It's number 53, Christy. And it was 16, it said, right? Um, this is the tag for that. Never mind. I'm losing it. I had the wrong tag in there. I had the tag for something else in there. Oh, bother. Oh, bother. Okay. So, with the holidays coming up, who doesn't need a gorgeous relish tray? Look at this beautiful depression glass relish tray 
with, this is elegant depression glass with the beautiful etched flowers. Isn't that gorgeous? I love it. There's no cracks. Um, there is a, uh, some little roughness on the underside of this this one here and on this side there's a little bit of roughness there like little flea bites um yeah no cracks yeah it's it's beautiful oh i already had my live christmas sale but you know what though um, after today, I am going to be incorporating Christmas stuff in my sales. Uh, well, actually, after the 23rd. Um, after the 23rd, I will be bringing in more Christmas because I have a collaboration um, that has Christmas stuff that I have to keep a secret. So... All right, so this beautiful uh, relish dish is $12, number 31. $12, number 31. Maggie M. Maggie, you got it, Maggie. It's pretty. I should have kept it for myself. <laughs> I would have used it for Thanksgiving. Uh -huh. All right. Now this I haven't washed. I have to wash it. But anyways. Okay. Next I have a Pyrex set. It is the a Pyrex Early American Pattern. And I have the large and the small Cinderella bowls, casseroles. This one does not have a lid but the large one does and it does have an issue it does have a chip right here okay but there it is and it's really in great condition both of these are in great condition other than the chip in the lid um they're nice and clean uh, this is the 475B, and it's a two and a half quart casserole. And this one is the 473 one quart casserole. But you can see, nice and clean. And there's really, um, the, the pattern is in great condition on both bowls. There's a little scratch right here. Yeah, they're really very nice. Uh, very nice pieces. Linda said, what did you sell them? Hmm? Nothing. Linda wanted, you're selling them as a set, right? Yeah, they're good. They're, they're as a set. And they are going to be $16 for the set number 18. $16 for the set number 18. Elizabeth. Elizabeth, you got it. All right. Um, all right, next I have a gorgeous, gorgeous piece. You guys might remember this. Uh, from Jessica's shower. It's this beautiful teapot. Um, she was going to keep it, but then she changed her mind. So this is just beautiful. It's in perfect condition. No cracks, no chips. There's the lid. The inside, and this is made by Household Institute, and it's called Priscilla. 
kitchen craft oven serve. So this is really um, a good size teapot. You could see it's just beautiful. And it is a really pretty cream color. And it has all the gold detailing. This is $20 and it's number 43. $20, number 43. All right. Need a May. Nita May, you got it, Dolly. All right. Uh, I don't have a thing for this, but I believe it's right there. Okay. Um, I have another offer up item, everyone. I think my last items are all offer up. No, I do have some more linens. Let me do these linens really quick. All right, next up I have this really pretty vintage apron. I'm gonna try and keep the tag over here. Look how pretty this is. Now it does have some little stringies and stuff on the bottom, which you could just trim off but it's in really good condition. Here's the, the uh, ties. Beautiful little apron. I think it's got carnations are the flowers. So this is gonna be uh, $10 and it's number 23. $10, number 23. Linda Dickerhoff. Huh? All right, Linda, you got it. That's a pretty one. All right. Okay, next I have, Um, I don't know where I put the, here it is. <laughs> Hang on, guys. All right, next I have this, this set of, what's the matter? 23 was given to the bird teapot. The duck one. So for the... I guess I really screwed up my tickets today. You don't even have that apron listed. So that okay. apron is going to be... 58. Okay, so the apron is number 58. And it's Linda. So, um, what do you, pink and red apron? Yeah. What were you asking? It was uh, $10. Okay, thanks, Nita. <laughs> okay. All right, next I have this set. It's just a set of two. Brand new, I am tired. <laughs> um, this set of two brand new placemats. They're a real, uh, they're a soft material. And they are. They look kind of felty. Okay. Yeah, they, they almost remind me of felt. I'm fired. <laughs> So these are going to be um, $8 and they're number four. How many are there? Two. $8, number four. <laughs> they're cute. All right. Linda should get the apron. Linda does get the apron. She, Lin Linda gets the apron. Yeah. Yeah. She's getting it. <laughs> All right. I have another apron here. Hopefully this one's on there. I've yeah, that one is. This one is. Okay. So. That one does have some markings on it, but. Okay, you, yeah. We originally got this from Misty. So. Yeah. So Jessica originally. 
Now where did this come from? Oh, good grief, Keisha. Oh, that goes to this. Um, we originally got this from Misty, Jessica, but then Jessica changed her mind and doesn't want it. So we're offering it to you. It's this really cute green apron. It does have um, it's a half apron. A, yeah, it's a half apron. There's it does some have a couple spots. Stuff, but again, um, this it, was, you know, we purchased it from Misty Sale. So, but it's really cute. I like the colors. So, this is going to be. $8, number 37. $8, number 37. There we go. Oh, you're buffering on my end. But I got Nita May. All right, Nita May. You got it. All right. So... Next, I have this beautiful vintage linen tablecloth, but it does have a stain on it. And it goes through to the other side as well. It has this stain right here, and it does go through, you know, to the other side. But that's really the only, um, like, major stain on the whole thing. Like, this is beautiful. And it is a 74 by 60, 74 by 60 tablecloth. So it's quite large. And so this tablecloth is $15 and it's number 23. $15, number 23. Yeah, it's big. It's it's a very good size. Happy and hung. Happy and hung. What was that number? Uh, number twenty-three. Girl, you did it again. I did it again. You grabbed the wrong tag again. No, I didn't. Because yes, this did. tag is in the bag. So far, we've had three number twenty-threes. <laughs> but it's okay. So whatever. It's still. <laughs> $15, so it's number 59 instead of 23. I don't know how I ended up with three 23s is beyond me. I don't know. So I need a drink. Blue and white tablecloth, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully this last tablecloth is the correct number. Well, I have a spot. 59, that's it, happy and hard. <laughs> My word. Okay. I have sold this tablecloth three times. And every time the sale never goes through. So I'm going to try one more time. It is this Dutch pattern, very colorful square tablecloth. Square tablecloth. It is a 50 by 50 tablecloth. You're having a gin and tonic, Cheryl? Shoot one up my way, would you please? Yes, it is a jinxed tablecloth. Now, it does have, I don't know, that looks like lipstick or something. Or paint. Or paint. I don't know what the heck that is. But it's a really, really nice, colorful tablecloth. Honestly, if you have kids, that would be cute as like a play mat because it's so colorful. And right. And you can do stuff with the shapes because there's hearts and stuff. So this tablecloth, as I said, it's a 50 by 50. It's $12 and it's number 47. Christy Garza. Christy. You got it, Christy. All right. Okay, I'm not even... Pennsylvania Dutch pattern. That's it, that. Pennsylvania Dutch. That's what I was forgetting, the Pennsylvania. I knew it was Dutch. 
All right. Thank you. Okay. So my last items are offer up items. Mm, I believe. Oh, it's not? I'm wrong. What a surprise. <laughs> All right. But other than that, yes. Okay. After this item, everything will be offer up. Okay. This. <gasps> Wait. Barb JM said she found alcohol made my hot flashes worse. Really? Oh, well. <laughs> I guess I'll have to suffer. <laughs> I like to have my cocktails. <laughs> oh, Carmen said, yes, they do. You could have been done with this t-shirt. Oh, baloney. Baloney. Anywho. Even when I even when I was doing that keto diet for like I don't know how many months it was, I wasn't drinking any alcohol at all, and I was still having hot flashes left and right. So, <laughs> Deanna, if you drink enough, though, <laughs> you won't feel them. <laughs> Linda, it's worth the hot flashes. <laughs> oh lordy, okay. So, I have this awesome vintage. <laughs> That's right. This awesome vintage nut dish. Um, it's in excellent condition. They even have felt on the bottom so it doesn't scratch the table. It's just so cool. This is $12 and it's number 10. Sit in a nice bath and drink. <laughs> Florence Taylor. Florence Taylor, you got it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, you guys crack Ooh. me up. What do I like? I like um vodka and tea. Vodka and iced tea I like. I like um beer. Beer in the summertime. Um I like vodka and tonic as well with some lime in it. Um okay. So, the last items which I have are let me see 1 2 3 I 3 items. Uh, I, think so. I think I have three items left, and they are all offer-ups. Can you bring me a Kleenex when you come back, Jess? I got a runny nose again from laughing. Like, really? How do you get a runny nose from laughing? Look at my hair. It's all, like, sticking up. Wow. I, what the heck is going on there? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Thanks. <laughs> Rum and Coke. A lot of people like that. You didn't get the earrings. I sent them, Virginia. From the unicorn hat. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Sorry. Oh, you like my business card? Thank you. Sorry, I had to wipe my nose. I had a runny nose. All right, as soon as Jessica comes back, we will finish with my sale with these offer up items. Crown Royal. Oh my goodness. Oh, thank you, Cheryl. I, I was I worked on it for a little while. I really liked the way it turned out. All right. So up next, let me just get my timer here, guys. I am starving. Okay. <laughs> you like anything fruity? Mango margaritas. There you go, Carmen. Yes. With blue cheese olives. Oh, oh my goodness, Dana. I love blue cheese and I love olives. I have this Catalina Pottery. 
console bowl. My good friend Ricky Donnelly uh, said uh, that what they used to use these for, um, they would put a block of um, oasis in here with, you know, like soaked wet and put flowers and all kinds of stuff in here. And um, so this is a California pottery piece, Catalina, California. It's a very pretty piece. There's the marking on the bottom. And this is 11 inches long by seven and a half inches wide. So we are gonna start the offers on this beautiful um, console bowl at $10 as soon as we put start in. Ready, set, start. $10 for this gorgeous Catalina Pottery console bowl. Very, very pretty. <clears throat> Jeffrey, are you making drinks? Which one has the bar in their house? Is it Judy Reardon? Mm -hmm. Judy Reardon's making drinks. I'll take a Virgin Sherry Temple, please. A Virgin Shirley Temple. You're making drinks now, Jeffrey, and you didn't invite me. 20 seconds, you guys. <laughs> She's drinking the loss of the Afghan. <laughs> 10 seconds. <laughs> 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, stop. <laughs> Jeffrey, did you say Mountain Dew? Yeah, and rum. Oh my gosh, you're going to be racing around and be drunk at the same time. <laughs> um, so it was $16 was the highest and it's Carmen Zermino because she was first. All right, Carmen, you got it. Linda. She yes, grabbed some Sh sangria, wait, wait, Veronica. Wait. Linda said the Shirley Temple is a virgin drink, but don't they make an alcoholic version? I don't know. Because I thought they did. Flipping and sipping. <laughs> Anyways, so the, the hey, pottery bowl girl. is for Carmen Zermino. So Carmen Zermino, you won the Catalina Pottery uh, console bowl. <laughs> All right. This will be a blast for the past for many of you. Just for old time's sake. Oh my gosh, I have that Pepsi. Disgusting. I have, I, it just kind of came up. I got Pepsi burps going on, guys. <laughs> Beg my pardon. Um, This awesome ballet box. And it's in really amazing condition. This is not a new item, okay? This is a vintage item, and it's really in great condition. So, and the one part, this is where you would put um, maybe your uh, your little uh, Dan skin, you know, your outfit. Your outfit. And then, listen to Cheryl. She said, curse you. <laughs> and then, over here, the shoes. your little shoes go in there. Look at that. Mm. Is that not the coolest thing ever? I mean. I love this. Mm. I think it is just amazing. So we are doing an offer up on this. What it, what's the matter, Cheryl? Excuse you. What's what's the matter? Did you burp? Oh, well, I kind of did, well, but I that? Maybe that Oh, okay, cuz I didn't let it out though. It just kind of, you know, whatever. <laughs> All right. So, 
We are going to start the offer ups. Yes, gotcha. <laughs> um, we are going to start the offer ups on this ballerina box at $12 and you will have one minute. All right, oh, everybody. She wasn't saying curse you. She was trying to say excuse you. I oh, because I saw it looked like it said curse, but then I looked again cuse. and it said cuse. Yeah. Yeah. And see these glasses, they're terrible. Can't see even with the glasses on. All right, ready, everybody? Starting at $12 and go. I just think this is so awesome. Oh, right, I know. It's just, you know what? It would just be cool for a display item. It's just so cool. I I love it. I, patent leather. I had a patent leather, a black patent leather Barbie case um, that I wish I still had, but I don't. And I had a big, thick, fat pink one. 30 seconds. <laughs> Lori, you're back. Yep, it's really, it's awesome. I love it. 20 seconds. You have your Barbie case? Aw, that's awesome. 10 seconds. Oh, you've been here drinking. <laughs> Lori. <laughs> All right, stop. <laughs> oh, you guys are too much. <laughs> Lori Wortley, 20 doll hairs. Lori, 20 doll hairs. You got it, girl. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's too funny. Okay, well, the last offer up item and the last item of my sale is. <laughs> So we're all going to sit here, do our makeup and have cocktails, get drunk. And then our, uh, you know, mascara will be running down our face because we'll be crying and, you know, all those fun things that we do when we're drunk. I so I have this amazing vintage makeup mirror. It is so cool. I showed you guys when I hauled it. It does work. Maybe. If I can uh, figure out the plug situation. Oh, that's why. It's a little... <laughs> it was a little bent. It was a little bent. You used to have one, sis? Yes. Sir. All right. Wrong one. And then we have different settings over here. I know you can't tell that they're changing, but... Yeah, this thing is awesome. <laughs> Sis said, I don't want to see everything that well. <laughs> oh my goodness. So, I mean, this is in great condition. The only thing is these little plastic pieces that go over the light bulbs, they, they're, I don't know if they're in there the right way or not. But I don't want to mess with them because I don't want to break them. So, all right, let me shut it off. <laughs> so, I don't know. We will start the offers on this thing at $15 and just go from there. I just think this is so awesome. I love it. So, and you know what's funny? It has all these settings on here. That's supposed to match the light. Yeah. Day. What does that say? Office. Office. Home. Home. Evening. And evening. You know? It's just hilarious. Guess what? When I put my makeup on, I put it on one way for any time of day. I don't care where I'm going. No, I think it's the light. Like, as you change it. Like no, I know. To alter the light. Yeah. But I thought that you're supposed to wear your makeup at certain um 
amounts for evening, day, well, like a lot of going out. Do, right, more makeup if you're going out right, clubbing or something. you know, something. I just wear my makeup the same way for everything. <laughs> All right. So we are going to start with $15. Ready and go. <laughs> I just love this. Carmen, sis. <laughs> oh, lordy, lordy. When I saw this, I was like, oh my God, please let it work. And I was so excited that it worked. All right, we are coming up on 30 seconds, everyone. Your dad bought you one for Christmas? Aw. How awesome. 20 seconds. I'm going to set this down now because. <laughs> uh, 10 seconds. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Stop. All righty. All right. Wow. I got... This magnifying side really shows all your wrinkles and your pores and your zits. I got sis for 24 doll hairs. Sis, $24. You got it. So I want to just tell you that... um. What I would do is take a piece of, where is the friggin' thing? There. I would take a piece of, you know the that rubbery foam um, shelf liner stuff? Take a piece and cut it and put it around here. Because these are worn and don't work the real well. Ones. So um, that, way, that way it won't um, slide on you. But yeah. Oh, awesome. Awesome! I just put in the email address for anybody who is new, which I don't think yeah. anybody was new today. Oh, you guys, you guys love you guys. You crack me up. I mean, we're all around the same age, so we, we all know what's up. So, <laughs> you guys kill me. So, I'm going to go have a drink now. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for coming. Oh, Florence is new. Okay, Florence. Florence? So, where's Florence? Florence Taylor. So what you do is um, the number of your item, you will send her an email and tell her, you know, what it was you purchased. Send her your shipping address with the zip code. Hi, Florence. Uh, your full name, if you, it is not the same as YouTube, as well as your PayPal email address. She will then weigh your item and send you an invoice, including the shipping to your location. There you have it. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Um, I don't know if I had anything else that I want. I did. Were you all here? I'm sure you all were not here, but I wanted to let you all know that my friend that I asked you to pray for is doing um, better. Well, there's more people here now, so I'm just letting the, the people know. She, um, she did end up having a heart attack, but she did get to the hospital in time. She had a blacked artery, and they took care of it, and um, she is now home. So I just wanted to thank all of you who said prayers for her, and she also wanted me to thank you as well. So, uh, thanks, guys. Thank, Thank you, you so much for coming today. Hi, Maria. Bye, Maria. Yeah, she's, that's, yeah, great news. So, all right, everybody. I will catch you really soon with a haul video because I have tons of stuff sitting in my living room. So, I'll be back. Bye, guys. Goodbye.